Hey guys, it's Saturday. Um, I'm getting ready to head out to Walmart, but we're just going to make it easy for ourselves and go to Dollar Tree first because my grandma wants um, me and my brother to take my other two brothers to Dollar Tree. So we're going to hit that first and then we're going to go to Walmart. They could probably just look around while I get my phone card and I have to pick up some new art pens because all of my black liners are dead and I'm like it's weird because I just bought a black liner Micron and I've only had it for like a couple of months and it died out on me and I'm like usually with Microns you can have them for like years and they don't die out to like a couple of years so I'm just going to pick up some Prismacolor ones because those lasted me a while last time so I'm sorry Mike Cron, but you got beaten. All right, so we reached our first destination, which is Dollar Tree. Oof, I gotta remember I have a budget. I cannot spend more than ten dollars. All days that I come to Walmart, they do not have the liners. Cries. Alrighty, so they didn't have the pins I wanted, but they did have sharp sharpie pins. So I'm like, I've used those before, so they're not that bad. So I hope they work with Prismacolor, because since I do a lot of colored pencil art, I hope they can withstand to the wax of Prismacolor. So now we're gonna head to go to Skillet, and then go home, play some more Disguise 3, and that's it. Hey guys, so we got home hour later after i finished eating oh i'm so full anyway i'm gonna show you what i got from dollar tree so i picked up this blue container because i really want to have another storage thing where i can keep like my paint not my paints but you know my inks and stuff because currently i have like a cup for my inks and i think these are a lot more useful because i really want to downsize the amount of stuff i have in my rooms um i also got this little storage unit i don't know what i'm gonna do with it yet it's really small i kind of wish dollar tree had the bigger one but they didn't and i'm i'm happy that they had this even because i'm like i love these i have this this is the same thing but um these are like really useful they hold a lot of stuff so i'm happy i found that at least and then i went to walk and the last thing I got from Dollar Tree, oh my gosh, is these glitter markers. I thought these were like freaking interesting. There's another type of marker I really want to try. Crayola has their own brush markers. And I really want to try that. So hopefully soon I could go pick some up because I think they're like 20 something dollars. I don't know. But then I went to Walmart. And I tried to find the Prismacolor liners, didn't have it, as you saw from my vlog there. So I just picked up some Sharpie pens, and I guess I got the special edition, because they're drawn on, which I think is quite cute. Um, and then I picked up some more high polymer erasers, because I needed more. Mine are like gone and out of this world, so I thought I'd pick up some more. These You get a pack of three of these for like a dollar, guys. They're really cheap, so um, I really want to test these out at least. I really want to test these out and see how they work because I looked really closely in them. They really don't have a lot of ink, which I'm quite sad about. I should have picked up two. These are like so pretty, oh my gosh.
Alrighty guys, so it's like 2 a.m. I am a sad life because I should be in bed right now, but I'm legit feeling non-creative with my original characters. So I'm like, you know what? It's time to do the funnest thing anyone can do, and that's to draw anime characters. I decided to start off with Koga from Inuyasha because I've never drawn him before, and he seems like a really fun character to draw, so I just drew him like kicking out. I forgot his tail i gotta put his tail in but i i, I don't know koga's a bay i freaking love him and i'm inking these with the sharpie pens and it's bleeding oh so bad on the other side and i'm like i'm gonna have to do this quick because i really don't want to make all the page bleed together so i'm gonna have to like be wise in my posing decisions but um yeah it's turning out really it's turning out really good so far i really like the dynamicness of the pose even though his legs are like really long but it's okay because sketchbooks are not perfection they're practice okay guys okay okay pretty guys so i just gotta drop off this paper at our registrar's office to certify that i'm graduating Alrighty, certified Alrighty, guys so i'm home from school i'm off of work today thank god i'm like so tired i almost fell asleep in class i'm just like narelle I'll leave 12 more minutes and you're out of here. <laughs> but um, like I said, I just applied for graduation. Um, I have to pay 20 bucks just for my little entry into our graduation. And then I got to pay 40 bucks for my cap and gown. Is it college great? Like, <laughs> I'm like, I'm happy that I'm graduating because I've been in this college, guys, for almost 10 years. That's how, that's how long I've been at this one college. It's a community college, so it's not a university. So I've just been at this college for 10 years and I'm like, it's about time for me to leave this place and not see it again. But I'm going to try to draw some today and just kind of not lay on my bed because I know if I lay on my bed I'm going to fall asleep so I will try not to do that today <laughs> and just be proactive because I haven't really been proactive at all for the past couple of days because I didn't really have a good day at work the day before yesterday and I just have been like low kind of limited a little bit so yeah that's pretty much it lost a dollar today so I'm mad about that but, um, yeah, I'm going to go eat now, <laughs> and hopefully I get something done. I have to get up Friday's video. I'm going to try to get Friday's video up today. That's going to be my little special video for you guys, so look out for Friday's video. All right, Koga is done. Like I thought, the ink bled really bad, but it's not too bad. I like it. Ah, when you have an art fail that you're just like, I hope I can save it. And now I'm like, I don't think I can save it. <laughs> I tried to make it all watercolor, but the colors weren't doing any justice. So I have to ink it. And I think the inking is saving it so far. I don't know. I just see all the flaws and I just want to be like, nope. Alrighty guys, so that's pretty much it for this vlog my vlogs are slowly becoming really short because i just don't have a lot of stuff to do anymore like i work like six hours and i go to school and when i get home i barely do anything so i'm like do what's like do i make vlogs as much as i do but i'm like if i'm committed to something i'm committed i really don't want to change my schedule again because just knock it off monday videos really has helped me and i'm i don't want to sit there and knock off wednesday because i really feel like that's not enough of me. Two days a week is fine. I do the occasional every other Saturday because I feel like the sketchbook updates are like a cute little addition to my uploads. But as for main, I think two videos a week is fine. So I'm not going to sit there and knock off the vlogs because I know you guys like hearing me and my beautiful face talk <laughs> every Wednesday. But um, I do have like an unboxing video I need to upload. So maybe be if nothing really happens this weekend i'll upload that on wednesday because actually next week is my spring break for my college but i'm probably not going to enjoy that because i gotta go to work probably on most of those days yay for being a freaking adult <laughs> why can't i stay forever 12 
<laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to shut up now and just finish editing this vlog. All right. Thank you guys so much. I love you. And I'll see you this Friday for my new video. Bye-bye.